Hi guys, Dave here from Wolf in the Wilds. We got another budget bushcraft for you. <sighs> I, I know I've been doing a lot of these, but I'm just, I'm super stoked that UST is now available in Dollarama here in Canada, which means you can get pretty much any product for about one, two, three, or four bucks. Um, most would be less than four but the one that I have right now I think was closer to the four dollar mark I uh, I gotta pay more attention when I when I do this um, but it's the wayfinding learn and live kit and this is something that absolutely anybody who spends time in the bush should probably get and familiarize themselves with um, it's just super invaluable to uh, to know how to use a compass and to, to you know kind of keep track of what you're doing when you're out in the woods. It's super easy to get lost in the woods when you're in unfamiliar territory. This is going to help you to not get lost, or if you do get a little turned around, you do get lost. It's going to help you find your way back as long as you've been using it properly in the first place. So let's get the camera shifted around onto the table here. We'll open this up and have a look. Okay. UST Wayfinding Learn and Live Kit. Contents on the back, which, eh, you know what, we're not going to spend too much time on that. We're just going to get her open. And once again, we got a carabiner on the back. And, whoop, sorry guys. Grab my little buck knife here. Get rid of that. little zap strap and this tape never really been a big fan of these uh, these cases to be honest um, I've never up to recently had one from UST but uh, I don't know they, they just they don't really seem to be super quality and you put stuff in them and they you know rattle around and make a lot of noise and I may have broken a piece already maybe possibly I don't know I don't know where that came from okay so Learn and Live Wayfinding Cards, and a base plate compass. Okay, right away we got an air bubble in there. That's not necessarily good. I don't have another compass in the trailer to test this against, but I can tell you right now, it's not that accurate. With a little bit of prodding, you can get it to uh, to, to face north, but it, it takes a little bit. This compass is not not very good quality at all. Now the wayfinding cards. A 
compass navigation basics types of compasses holding a compass what is a bearing what is a bearing using a compass with maps compass with maps, orienting a compass with a map, orienting, plotting a course, plotting a course, navigating around an obstacle, navigating around, finding your way out, declination magnetic north versus true north, GPS digital compass versus analog compass. So, <clears throat> never been a fan of these, as I said. And, you know, I mean, I don't really think that uh, having a UST one is really going to change my mind at all. Yeah. Compass itself. Nah, I can you see the the bubble up here? It just No. No, that that doesn't impress me at all. But these these are worth the price of purchase. This will will give you the basics of what you need to know when you go and get a better compass. So, would I buy it again for the cards? Yeah, I think so. Um, it's, it's nice to have something to reference while you are in the field. You can't remember everything. And uh, when you get lost in the woods, the first thing that you do is to calm down sit down and and just think rationally don't get excited don't panic don't start wasting calories that you don't need to and having little reference cards like this you could sit down you could read you can kind of refresh yourself you can think logically and and plan a, a your your next move you plan a mode of attack if you will um I think things like these in a survival pack are are invaluable for a number of reasons, um, aside from the information that that you can get on. So yeah, I I would uh, I would at least buy these cards. And I mean for the I don't know three or four bucks that it cost me to buy this thing, the the cards are worth it to me. So uh, yeah, I, I really don't know what. Uh, what I really expected from the dollar store. Um, all in all, I, I had hoped with the name UST on it that, uh, you know, be a little better than that. But not a total loss. So we'll keep these for my camp pack. And uh, we'll call this a video. <laughs> Have a good one, guys. We'll see you in the next video. Until then, stay wild.